been like elephants, they should be smaller. Well, then you'll have approximately 12,000 years to lay. Because back then in Cyprus, you could see those pygmy elephants, which are the smallest elephants that we know of. You could also come across pygmy hippos, which doesn't sound as cool because we have them today, but they're more closely related to actual hippos. So now you get the idea that the term megafauna hardly applied to Cyprus. Because Cyprus is an island and things tend to get a little bit weird on islands. You know, big species tend to get smaller, but small species tend to get bigger. So what caused those pygmy elephants? Perhaps food was scarce and smaller animals had an advantage. Or the lack of any weird carnivores meant they could get smaller without getting eaten. Whatever it was, it probably ended when we arrived. Because we might not be carnivores, but we're pretty potent omnivores. And just like you should be scared of polar bears, even though they're omnivores, well, the megafauna should be scared of us. Because we aren't that great for megafauna. It's hard to reconstruct completely, but three thousands of us might have been enough to seal the deal. Meaning this is the only pygmy hippo that we know of today.